The Cultural Protection Fund is a program that the British Council is doing in collaboration with uh, the DCNS, the UK government, which is the Department for Culture, Media and Sports. And the idea is to look at protecting heritage in uh, both tangible and intangible. Uh, the program has been running in about 16 countries and we're, we're really keen to bring it to Pakistan. We've held some capacity building workshops. One of those is in partnership with the Citizens Archive of Pakistan. Citizens Archive of Pakistan began in 2007. Uh, we are a registered not-for-profit organization, the only one in the country that is dedicated to historic and cultural preservation. Uh, we do two main things. We build and maintain our archive, uh, material, rare maps, photographs, books, and also oral testimonies that have to do particularly with the generation that's our partition. We have recorded over 4,500 oral history with this account and digitized nearly 700,000 photographs which all weave together to create the story of Pakistan through its citizens. Um, we also have expertise in curation, where we use the rare material in our archive and bring to the public um, educational public awareness exhibitions and museums. Our collaboration with the Citizens Archive has come about as a result of the background work that we have been doing on CPF, the conversations that began last summer about the feasibility of bringing CPF to Pakistan developed into this grant opportunity that um, we were able to get, you know, set up with um, the Citizens Archive. Um, they have created a set of workshops for us on training for specifically archiving, which is their expertise and their forte in Pakistan. It brings together people from educational institutions, from cultural organizations, and even individuals, artists, everybody who's interested in the archiving of tangible or intangible heritage. And um, we opened up the opportunity to the sector. We had a, a workshop in Lahore and in Karachi, and also with the potential and the opportunity um, to remain in touch with CAP and for a mentoring um, relationship with CAP where as people go on to either build their archives or work further on their existing archives, they have that ongoing support. So this is exactly the kind of um, thing we wanted to do as preparation for the CPF launch in Pakistan.